Next game up, the Cowboys at the Patriots. This is the 425 p.m. Eastern time game. And at, this is, you know, when if, if Brady was still with the Patriots, this would be a monstrous number. I think it's still going to be big anyway. Uh, but the Cowboys, Dan Quinn. Dan Quinn has gotten that defense turned around for the Cowboys. And, you know, they are 5-0 and against the spread thus far this season, sitting at 4-1 and straight up. Patriots are a four-point dog here, total of 50 and a half. And I, I, I like to believe in Bill Belichick getting it done at home and whatnot. I don't think this is the spot for it. These numbers look very similar to the Giants going down to Dallas last week. We both said on the show we expect the Cowboys to win by double digits, and they did. I don't know that they win by double digits here, but they don't have to. They just got to cover four. I think that they're going to be able to do that. Dallas, the number two DVOA team, total DVOA in the in the league. New England, number 20. Dallas's offense is number four. Their defense is number six. New England's offense is number 24. The New England defense is number nine. Dallas is better at every facet of the game than New England, including special teams, including everything else. So far through the season, I I think... I think I'm going to have to roll with the Cowboys until they give me a reason not to. This is a really well-coached team right now that appears to be clicking on all cylinders. That's a, that, that, it shocks me to say this, but that's where we're at, Gary. I mean, it's just where we're at. This, it's not just what the Cowboys are doing, which is amazing, and they should get all the credit in the world for it. it, it it's also what the Patriots are doing, all right? They're just not very good right now. I think we've reached a point where... A, they don't have – Bill Belichick has let that roster get to a place where they just don't have a lot of talent, okay? Um, I, I think he's mismanaged and misappropriated the roster pretty well, uh, or I guess pretty badly, to, uh, to, to be able to hang with anybody in the NFL right now. I mean, they're just not better talented-wise than anyone, anyone at all. Mystique and Magic isn't going to win it for you. Yeah. No, it's – I mean, it's bad, and without James White, uh, you got you got major problems. Which you know they lost him a couple weeks ago, but now you got uh, you got Harris dealing with the rib injury. You know, I, I mean, I think he'll be fine. But I mean, you you just got all kind of injury, and Bill always does that. He tosses a bunch of guys on the uh, on the injury report, but they got a bunch of them right now, and the Cowboys are clicking. I mean, they are absolutely clicking right now. So, are you you going to take the Pats just based on loyalty, or uh, are you riding Cowboys minus four here? No, man, I mean, the Cowboys are, I mean, I love the Patriots, but, it, it, you know, I'm not going to bet against them by any means, but that's like, you got you to gotta take the Cowboys. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.